Okay, check this out. I'm going to say a word that you might have heard before, but you might not know exactly what it means. Ready? Drum roll, please. The word is discipleship. Ever heard that word before? Kind of interesting big word, huh? Discipleship. What is it? Is it like a kind of boat? Like, hey, look, it's discipleship. Yeah, it's definitely not that. So what does it mean? Well, it's actually something pretty cool, like in a change your entire life kind of way. To find out what it means, we gotta go back in time, way back. I'm talking like a few thousand years back to when Jesus was here on the earth. Wait, you didn't know Jesus was actually here on earth? That's right, Jesus, you know, the son of God, born in a manger, died on a cross, that Jesus. He was a real person who lived in the real world and did real stuff. And everything he did, was all about one thing, making a way for us to be close to God. You see, God is perfect. He's all-powerful, all-knowing, completely and infinitely good. But people? Eh, not so much. We're kind of a mess, and on our own, we're pretty much stuck that way. Before Jesus came, people had some relationship with God. They could talk and be together, kind of. But at the end of the day, there was still this big gap between us. And enter Jesus. His life, death, and resurrection made a way for us to be with God. Remember how we're over here and God is over here? Well, Jesus is kind of like a bridge. And so now, because of him and through him, we can be close to God. So let's come back to now. What does all of this mean for my real life, like today? When we follow Jesus in our everyday life, in what we think about, what we say, everything we do, it's like we're taking steps across that bridge. That's what being a disciple is, following Jesus in every part of our life. And you want to know something even cooler? Following Jesus in discipleship does more than just get us from here to someday over here. As we take steps along the way, our everyday life can change too. We can have peace instead of worry, joy instead of sadness, a life overflowing with real love and hope and boldness with a firm foundation of who we are. A life all about Jesus, all because of Jesus. That's being a disciple. Bringing it back around, that's discipleship. See, and now you know what that big old word means. Look at you, little smarty pants, all knowing big words and whatnot. I always knew you could do it.